Hey friends, and welcome to another edition of Timmy Talks. Today, we are going to the Goshala, or the house encampment of cows. Krishna has uh, been associated with cows. And so there is a place where the cows are taken care of and fed and have used their milk for worship and all of that. So we're gonna go check it out. Come along, should be fun. On my walk to the Goshala, I came across this nice hand-painted wall. Looks great. You are welcome to visit our Goshala. Hmm. There's a Goshala here too. Look, look where the cows are. You can see. It's not the Vrindavan one, but it's a nice Goshala. We keep going. Well, this walk is nice. This is someone's property that's enclosed. I like that, that's nice. So, we are getting closer. Says Agoshala is down this road. Let's go see, huh? So it's a nice little area back here. Funny that. It's like the city is right there. Turn right. Hmm. I don't know where we turn right. So it's my understanding that they take stray cows in, especially if they've been injured or hurt or sick. And of course that they have other you know, normal cows that they keep um, and tend to. <laughs> Hi, Krishna. Look at the cows. And I love this area back here. It's like not far from the city, but yet you feel so like disconnected from the city. So like in the country and back to nature. I love it. I think it's past feeding time and it's now. I think it's past feeding time and it's now more like siesta time. Here's all the bulls. So many different types. Big horns, let's see if I can zoom in. Wow, look at that one. <laughs> All the boys are separated here. But nobody's sitting in the mud pile. <laughs> Although, I don't know if you can see it. There's a lot of mosquitoes in that mud pile. Look at. You see the water kind of moving? Oh, I got mosquitoes on them shooing away. Those are mosquitoes. Your destination is on the right. Those are mosquito larvae. So, we will be brief. <sighs> but here's all the boys. Hanging out. different kind of cows, all different kinds of bulls, I should say. Here's 
the more cows, but I don't see any in the pens. Just some more bulls. There's all the feeding troughs, if you can see. All the feeding troughs. They must let them in all at once and feed. Let's see what's over here. Let's see what we got. There's more. You can see them feeding them. It's making so much noise over here. Who is making the noise? Such noise makers. Wow. Look at these guys. Eating away, eating away. This guy's the big noise maker. It's nice to see them. <laughs> Happy eating their food and wagging their tails. It's nice to see that. Hey, guy. Hey, guy. Oh, hey, girl. Hey, girl. She's like, she had to, she had to get her displeasure out. And now she's ready for, these are all the girls, and now she's ready for dinner. Wow. Let's go see if there's anything else around the side. Oh, this is interesting to see. They have a big bristle thing there where the cows can scratch themselves. Yeah. She's like, what's going on? Where's the food? Get them. Floppy ear cow. <laughs> cool. And then I think that there's a few more left over here. You can see. Watch your step. Get them milking the cows, no? Yeah, you can get a better look. Hello. 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 Nice. Nice, nice. Any more over here? Um, yeah, on the other side. They have more cows over there. Hare Krishna. Like I can just look real quick. I'm probably not supposed to be in here, but I just wanted to see. Oh, cow peeing, okay. Look, different kind of cows. Hmm. They are eating. Just hanging around. Nice. So they're getting their food trough ready. They're gonna let them in here in a few minutes and let them eat. <laughs> so you can see they have all the hay over here. Oh, there's a monkey. Be careful for your phone and your bag. And then getting all the hay and alfalfa. Putting them in the troughs. And here's the babies. Oh, here's a monkey. Monkey, monkey. And here's the baby cows. Have to separate them from the big cows, otherwise they might be trampled. Hello. 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 I wish I had an apple to give you. Hello. Look at all them over there. They're hiding. So cute. Look at him. That's a lot of work. That's a lot of work. Hmm. Uh, and then we're putting those in the trough. They know where to go. Oh, 
that one wants to break free. Like, I'm leaving. You let me out. I'm leaving. I'm going. <laughs> and they're like, hey, where'd our friend go? Where did our friend go? Where did our friend go? Where did the friend go? Huh? Where did the friend go? Everybody's got to see. What's going on here? What's going on here? Oh my goodness, now everyone wants to come visit. Who's this? Move out of my way, huh? Move out of my way. Where did your friend go? Let's see. <laughs> I don't know where he brought the food. But that one escaped. I had an escaped cow. So they collect the milk and then they bring it to the idols. They use it on the idols and during puja and artis. So they take care of the cows and in return they use it for religious purposes. I also think that I saw that there was a store here that you can buy some products like um, milk products like soap and things like that that they make from from the milk. Oh, there's the little one that got us got away. See, and he's milking the cow. Look at that. There's cows. They're eating and they're being milked. There's one suckling from the mom. But here's a guy actually collecting the milk. on all day all day and all night i think actually the goshala is open 24 hours a day in case you know you wanted to get your cow fix in you could come by and see the cows so i hope you enjoyed your visit to the iskan cow center um it was an exciting experience to be close to the cows and to see how they're taken care of so we will see you next time and please do like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye now.